Hi, dudes. I am Ollie, the ultrasound robot. Ultrasound is a cool way for doctors to look inside your body. I have got some selfies of people who know all about ultrasound. Ben was ill when he was six. He had so many ultrasounds he lost count. Kate is a doctor who does ultrasounds every day. They are going to tell you all about this. See how many times you can see me in the video. Let us find out about ultrasounds now. The ultrasound happens in what's called the Children's Radiology Department. Um, the hospital website has lots of information about how you can get to the hospital. The parking can be a little bit of a trouble sometimes, so it might be worth trying to come by the park and ride or by walking if possible. It's a good idea to leave early so you'll get a car park and get to your appointment on time. When you reach the children's radiology department there is a receptionist who you need to book in with and you'll have been sent a letter, it's best to bring the letter with you um, and they'll ask you a few questions just checking that they've got the right address, the right telephone number for, for you or your parents um, and just make sure that we're expecting you and that we know you're here. I have to go to the reception and hand the letter in so they know that we're here and then they check it's me by asking what's my date of birth and my name and what year I was born and then I have to wait in the waiting room for my doctor to call me. You should get a letter with your ultrasound appointment that will tell you if you need to do anything special before the scan. So for a number of scans we need you to come not having eaten for a few hours beforehand because we just get slightly better views of the of the organs inside your tummy for that. I can't eat stuff sometimes when I have ultra scans, but sometimes I also have to drink quite a lot. We might ask you to come having drunk lots of water so that you really need like you feel like you need to go to the toilet and that's when your bladder is full and your bladder is what collects your wee before you go to the toilet and it's really useful for us to have a look at that if you've maybe been having some problems with your kidneys. You don't have to wear a hospital that gown, you can um, wear your normal clothes as you can. There's no need to wear any special gowns, um, just come in your own clothes and we'll probably just lift up your top uh, if we're scanning your tummy or um, get your jumper taken off if we're looking at your neck, just so that we can get to the bit of the body that we need to scan. Your mum or dad or anyone you would like to bring with you can definitely come with you to, to the scan and they can sit in one of these chairs right next to you and be there the whole way through. Your mum and dad can come in the room with you, so you don't have to be on your own. The room is quite dark, but there is lights, and you have a pattern up on the roof you do that you look at. The ultrasound scan is done using this machine behind me, um, and there's no needles, it shouldn't hurt in any way at all. We put some gel on the um, little cameras we use first, because the sound waves don't go through um, air very well, so we need a little layer of something other than air between you and the camera. And the stuff we use just looks a little bit like colourless shower gel, and it doesn't smell of anything either, and we just wipe it all off at the end. The um, gel's cold and it feels all wobbly and wobbly like when you touch jelly. They put that on your tummy so they can see the pictures a lot better. There are some funny noises but that comes from the inside of you. You have to move around when they ask you to. It's not painful at all. What I see on my screen is a black and white picture of whatever it is I'm scanning. So what we're really doing is managing to look inside your body by using sound waves. All the doctors are friendly and nurses and you're just be asked to move around, to lie on your tummy, your side or your back. There isn't anything to be scared of actually. So for us to get the best possible pictures we need to be able to see our screen really clearly and we can see it a bit better when the lights are dim. Um, and we also have some fish on the ceiling which you can see behind me but they're usually up on the roof um, and you can see those better with the lights down as well. We usually give about 20 minutes for the scan. Sometimes it takes a little bit less than that. Sometimes it takes a little bit more, depending on which bit of your body we're scanning. To come back and get the results, and they tell you if it's looking good and what they find. The person who's actually doing your scan, which will either be one of the doctors like myself or one of the um, radiographers, can tell you straight after the scan what they've seen, but will also send a proper report to the doctor that's asked for the test. So the doctor that referred you for the scan um, will be able to discuss the results with you when you next see them. It's okay if you are a little bit worried, but there's nothing to be scared of. 
it's quite good that you have an ultra scan because it makes sure you're doing fine and you don't have to worry as much then because you know if you're doing good or if you're recovering well. So really there's nothing to worry about at all. You get to come in here, watch television, we scan your tummy or whichever bit of the body it is that needs scanning. We usually then give you a sticker if you've been good and then you get to go home. <laughs>